Hey folks, Post here, welcome back to another Pokemon Master video, and today we're gonna go over, keep on going over, I guess, some of the, I guess, uh, sync pair predictions, um, for, for their Pokemon, um, in game, for trainers that aren't actually in the game yet. So, uh, today we're gonna go over champions, which, there are, are really, you know, there's not that many champions. <laughs> Although, we don't have too many that's in the game at the moment, we got, we got blues in the game, right, lances in the game, champion, we do have champion version lance, right? Uh, Blue, Lance, um, Steven's in the game, Wallace, kind of, sort of, maybe, Cynthia's in the game, and yeah, that's all, that's all, <laughs> right? So there's a lot to go through, so uh, let's let's go through them then. Um, let's go, let's talk about Trace first, everyone's favorite champion. Not really. <laughs> uh, I don't know, maybe someone likes Trace, I personally was kind of male, Trace. Um, yeah, let's, uh, yeah, uh, Trace. Trace, I think... I mean, all of these are possibilities, but I do think the very likely one is Jolteon. Um, because one, you know, Raichu, Pikachu's already in the game. Lola and Raichu is a thing, right? So we probably would take Jolteon just because Jolteon is kind of his ace, and also it's the evolution of Eevee, right? <laughs> let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee. Um, and Eevee, he, get, he gets the evolution of Pikachu, and, and, you know, Pikachu gets the evolution of Eevee. Which is North Jolteon, which would also make sense because also the highest level on his team. So, if I were to guess, it's probably going to be Jolteon. As for Pidgeot, uh, Blue already has Pidgeot. So, <laughs> uh, like talk about there. Rapidash, Blaine has Rapidash, Erica has Vileplume. So, either I guess Jolteon, Marowak, Slowbro, maybe Raichu. But again, of all these three, I would, I would, I would assume it's probably Raichu, right? Um, oh, not Raichu, <laughs> Jolteon. <laughs> so, there we go. Uh, moving on, let's talk about red. We have Cygnusuit red in the game, not regular red. So let's talk about champion red. Champion red, uh, probably going to take a Pokemon from his, you know, gold silver team, right? Um, his gen 2 team. Uh, if I were to guess, well, there's not much guessing. <laughs> Pikachu's already in the game. Lapras in the game. Charizard's in the game. Blastoise, Venusaur are coming to the game. So at least us with Snorlax, which I'm totally fine with. That's a uh, really reasonable, right? Red and Snorlax makes a lot of sense honestly right uh, moving on let's talk about wallace because like the 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 wallace that's already in the game again like it doesn't mean that when he does come out it's going to be this pokemon right it's a possibility but it's not like 100 percent guaranteed um and also they didn't really mention if the wallace that was there like they kind of hinted that it might be gym leader wallace just because of how he refers to Steven, but he never, you know, there's no confirmation that it was Gym Leader Wallace or Champion Wallace, right? So, that yeah, could be Champion Wallace, could be Gym Leader Wallace. But anyways, in terms of his Pokemon, I think my uh, Milotic is a pretty safe pick, right? Wallace and Milotic, um, since it also appeared in the game as well. So there's that. If anything else, maybe Whale Lord for Champion Wallace, right? Whale Lord or Ludicolo, maybe Wishcash, but again, the most, you know, obvious pick over here is Milotic. So, uh, moving on, Alder, which after I just, I, cause you know, if, if guys watch my streams, I just finished black and white for the first time. This guy is great. I don't know why people don't mention him, um, as often, but I, he's a really, really good champion. Like as a person, right? Um, you know, his, his, his philosophy about what it means to be a really strong trainer or whatever that. He, um, you know, communicates with Sharon and all that. I don't know why people don't like him. This guy's great, <laughs> but he's not in the game. So let's talk about his um, potential Pokemon, right? So all of his, all of his um, Pokemon here um, of different types, even though he does have like three bug types. And they're all Gen 5, so I would guess it's probably Volcarona, honestly, just because, it, one, it's his highest level. One, two, it's really strong. <laughs> and uh, three, kind of looks like his hair. <laughs> the kind of look looks like his hair honestly gives it more points than anything else but also i guess maybe a uh, bouffant uh, could also be a possibility maybe excelgore or xavier i don't think it i don't see it being a uh, dragon or, or vanillix honestly drudagon whatever um but yeah if it were to be anything i'd pr i'd probably guess volcarona so there's that moving on to iris champion iris um, which by the way, she is champion in black and white too, apparently. 
uh, which I haven't played yet, and I will be streaming later today, so tune in if you, want, if you guys want to see me play Black and White 2 for the first time after just finishing um, Black and White 1, specifically Black 1, specifically Black 2. So, anyways, um, oh, what's, what's a challenge mode? Anyways, uh, let's go over our team. Um, her team's kind of weird. I mean, she was like the dragon type gym leader, right? And she's supposed to be like this dragon type gym leader or, or dragon type champion, but like only half of her team is champion or is, is dragon type. Like Archeops Rock Flying, Lapras Water Ice, Agron Steel Rock. Um, so let's take these three out. I don't think it's going to be any of these three. I also don't think it's going to be Drudagon just because it's probably going to be like either. It's, I just think it's probably going to be Drayton's Pokemon, honestly. That's why I don't think it's uh, Drudagon. And Haxorus, she already has Haxorus, right? As regular um, Iris, like, you know, um, Gym Leader Iris, right? That leads us with Hydreigon. <laughs> a lot of people will say, oh, maybe Getsus might get Hydreigon, which makes a lot of sense, right? Uh, but what if Getsus gets Kirim instead? Then Hydreigon, then Iris could get Hydreigon, right? So I think that's also a possibility. Um, if we're looking at any of these other Pokemon she's had, yeah, yeah, probably Hydreigon. <laughs> maybe Archeops, maybe Archeops, I guess. Hydreigon or Archeops, if I already guess here. So, moving on, Diantha. Everyone's favorite champions that's not in the game yet, I guess, maybe. <laughs> I don't know, just, I just see a lot of people requesting for her. Uh, mostly, I would say more be, more so because of Gardevoir than Diantha herself. Um, does seem like, uh, because uh, everyone keeps on asking for fair types in the game, and with good reason, right? So, um, her sync pair is probably going to be um, Halucha. No, it's not good. It's going to be Gardevoir. It's going to be a Gardevoir slash Mega Gardevoir. Uh, by the way, it's already kind of confirmed. Um, if you guys, like, reboot the game and the title screen, there's, like, this wallpaper um, with a bunch of characters and Diathas there with Mega Gardevoir already. So there's not much to talk about here. It's it's going to be Mega, uh, Mega Gardevoir. So, uh, moving on, let's talk about Leon, I guess, even though he's Gen 8. But, like, there's not that many champions to talk about, and I'm slightly curious as well. So let's let's go check him out. Um, championship match. Uh, I guess it's probably either Charizard or, or Dragapult, right? The only thing with Charizard is Charizard's are, well, already in the game. But if they could give him, like, a special Gigantamax Charizard, then maybe. Right? G-Max Charizard. Um, which makes it a bit different from Mega Charizard X that, uh, that Sigma Red has. So that could be a possibility. I see another possibility being... Dragapult, which is, I guess, a more likely scenario, just so it doesn't conflict with Charizard, right? I don't see him getting anything. Oh, uh, maybe Aegis Slash, just because it's, you know, Sword and Shield, right? <laughs> but uh, aside from that, oh, never mind. Aegis Slash, Aegis Slash is already in the game with um, Wixroom. Sorry about that. Poor Wixroom. Uh, but yeah, Dragapult. <laughs> Probably going to be Dragapult. So, um, anyways, and this guy, no one knows much about Mustard. I think he's like the old champion of Galar region. That's in the, like, the DLC thing. Uh, well, maybe Mustard and Cub food, but again, we don't know much about him. I don't, there's no point speculating at the moment. But uh, yeah, there we go. That's all the uh, champions that aren't in the game yet. Uh, I guess for the most part, um, how many are in the game at the moment? Let's see one, two, three, four, four out of yeah, yeah. It does seem like they do follow like a bit of a ever since they introduced uh pokey fair banners right like they've all been on poke fair banners like even red even though it's signature red like not championship uh champion red right but um cha he's not like champion champion but like he's he's champion 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 <laughs> red, red, red's a weird case red's a weird case uh but you know steven cynthia lance they they're all on poke fair banners right as well as Cygnus Suit Red. So, would it be safe to assume all of these, if they do come to the game, will be on Poke Fair banners? Poke Fair Trace, anyone? <laughs> but uh, yeah, again, now that's my for this one. I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know you guys think in the comments down below about uh, these different champions that are in the game yet and what potential sync pairs they could have as well. Um, there are a few that I'm not like, 100% sure of, right? Uh, because Trace, I'm not s extremely sure of. Iris, just because of the, like the Getsus thing with Iris, right? Getsus, Iris, Hydreigon. So uh, yeah, again, uh, let me know 
all of that in the comments down below. Like and enjoy the video, subscribe to my channel for some more promo Mavis content. Um, again, I will be streaming Black 2 later today, so that should be cool, I guess, maybe. Um, hey, I did enjoy Black 1 for the most part, so hopefully it's good. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.